realize that I've been late on this bag. I've been slipping on this bag. And so even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never ran, said a no, man, I still go. Go, 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 go. Hello, my darlings. It's Dion Dean. Welcome back to another video. I have a very special purchase. I told you guys something, something fabulous was coming. And if you are part of, or if you take a look at my YouTube community and you follow me on Instagram at I am Dion Dean, then I gave you a sneak peek. Okay, I, I told you I made a purchase. I've I've really been good about not spending for my trip to Portugal, but when I saw this, I had to have her. And so shout out to Jesse from Cappuccinos and Consignment. Honey, when your friends are influencers, just stay off of their page because they put all these links up and then you get to clicking on links and then you get to clicking on the website in the link. So, yes. So I'm gonna show you what it is. We're gonna unbox it together. Haven't opened it guys, but you can see from the packaging that this is from Coach. And so I saw this bag and I immediately, when I saw this bag, started to do some research and realized that I've been late on this bag. I've been slipping on this bag. And so This is so out of my color palette. For those of you who are moms with kids with grubby fingers, mm, I hope that I'm doing, I haven't been in Boston in a very long time. <laughs> oh Lord, hold on. This is the, oh gosh, okay. They got this better than they had Louis Vuitton. <laughs> Oh, wow. Oh, okay. Okay with the packaging. This is the... This is so good, y'all. Especially with the luggage that I just got. This is the Field Bag 40-inch Horse and Carriage. Oh, oh. Let's look at this together. This is embossed, raised, coach. The coach logo, of course, is the Horse and Carriage. We have, oh, suede. We have, oh, hold on. Let me look. I didn't even look at this bag. I'm up here showing you the feet. Oh, 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 oh. So this is my travel bag for Portugal. I don't want to take. I don't want to take off the handle because oh, cream. I'm just so. I'm just so scared of cream and a white with as much with as with as much Chanel foundation as I wear. But I just want to show you. Oh my, oh my, oh my. And so this bag was originally, this is what really got me to click in a way. It was $650 and it came down to $200 over Labor Day weekend. I'm gonna leave a link to it in the description box. I and they had it in red too. It was between this one and the red one. And so I was like, for that amount of discount, I can. Do a little splurge. Now, if you're part of the D&D family, then you know that $200 is, is um, not a splurge. I can really go big, go home. But for me, this bag is worth so much more. Like, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This will go to tell you it's not about the price. There are some bags on the market right now that are not worth, let me not go there. Let's not, let's, let, let's keep it, let's keep it light. They packed this thing. Look at this. I'm telling you. Anybody who has gotten a bag from a luxury brand, they don't package the bag like this. Oh, God. <laughs> Do y'all see this? They, they said, listen, for $650, we will make you feel like you spent thousands. This is, look at that. Here you go. He wants to eat something. No, these are not for you, sir. These are not for you. We are doing a whole unboxing. Wow. I mean, for the environment, it's not that great. I ain't gonna lie. So this is the strap. Oh my gosh, hold on. They covered every part of this bag. The packaging, coach. So I saw this bag and then I realized 
I have been slipping on coach. Cause these field 40 bags, I feel like this is definitely not gonna be the first one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Guys, if you want a luxury experience, you are gonna get one. I feel so, <clears throat> excuse me. I feel so taken care of and thought about. Okay, that's a lot of paper coach. <laughs> okay, here goes my Going to eat the paper. All right, so here is the bag. This is going to be my travel bag. And actually, it's going to be my work bag. I'm not one of those people to just kind of like, except for I have a Telfar bag out, out here because I want to show you in comparison. Um, the Telfar bag is the one that I typically travel with. So let's get in here. So this is, let's get in here. Let's get in a little closer. So here. Here he goes crying. He wants to go outside. So, oh my God. I hear you, baby. I hear you. I'm going to take you out. I promise. Okay. Let's just show your aunties and your uncles this bag. Look at the interior. Look at that. Let's throw that poison out. I'm not going to do it in here because he will eat it. But just the way they wrapped everything. The only thing that makes me a little anxious because whenever they put this rubber on here, I feel like they don't do it to last. And even on vintage coach bags, um, the rubber starts to wear. So if you have any idea of how we can keep that nice, I definitely know that this is gonna get, you know, it's not gonna stay cream, which was one of the concerns. I wanted to get the red one over this one because of that. But what a beautiful travel bag slash work bag. So then, it's kind of, I need to cut this off. It's not supposed to go right here. It's supposed to go right here, but. All right, so let me throw all of this out, take him for a walk, and then I'm gonna show you this bag versus um, my Telfar bag, which is a bag that I travel with most. Okay, guys, so this is my Telfar Loose Knuckles bag. This is what I typically travel with. I don't put, why am I trying to put it over? I don't do that. Um, I just felt like it was so long that I needed to, should I try? Oh, for the interwebs to see. You know what? I've never, I've never done it because of my tatas. But okay. Um, I typically am here with it, or it sits on top of my luggage while I wheel my luggage. Um, but this is what I typically travel with. I will leave a link to the video where I did an unboxing for this, like two years ago, whenever I got this. Um, and I will leave a link to this because I don't know. I know they I know they've done different collaborations but I don't know if this anyway if I can find it I will link it in the description box so for size comparison because some of you have um, totes that are of this size so if for size comparison these are the two bags together I hope that it's within frame I believe it will be but these are the two bags by comparison this one is definitely wider in terms of width this um, I ain't gonna lie to you guys this Telfar bag carries all my sins, okay? <laughs> and so that's why I was just like, I don't know. You can see I have everything in here. Everything from when we went to Canada. I got wig caps. Let me take that out because I'm going to definitely need that. I got extra wig caps. I got eye mask. Oh, I have an extra clipper. Okay, I'm looking for that. Uh, I got my wipes. Got my travel socks. You guys better be traveling with your travel socks. I should have put that in my international video. Um, you gotta, you don't have to, but compression socks. If you're traveling overseas, you definitely wanna have your compression socks. Um, but this carries, sorry, I didn't clean it out, guys. Forgive me, it's real life. Um, this carries a lot. And so I do not know, no, that's a lie. I know what I'm bringing but I don't know how heavy it's gonna bring after doing, you know, doing some reviews. One of the things that they said, um, other people that had this bag, um, is that you should get um, one of the thingamahoozies that you put in here to make sure, just the, like the thing you put in the bottom of the Speedy to make flat thingy, you know what I'm talking about. Um, so Mavericks and Grady. So this I know I'm gonna have, I definitely know, just from putting that in there, this is not gonna carry a lot. Does it, does it sink? It sinks a little bit. Ooh, but it is heavy. It's definitely heavy. Those two definitely I'll have in there. My toiletry bag, because you're not gonna catch me slipping. If they lose my luggage, 
You ain't gonna lose my arm. <laughs> you lose my luggage, you're not, you're not gonna lose my toiletry bag. So in comparison, cause again, I have a layover. And so this is gonna be with me for the entire trip and I need to be able to, okay. So this is definitely, I don't know. I think maybe because the weight is distributed in this more. Mm. My husband will say you're doing too much. So I just have my toiletry bag. Let's do that again. Let's do that again. My toiletry bag, it's definitely smaller. I usually have a book or two. Where's, um, I know I'm taking the proximity principle with me because I want to read that again. Where is it? Where's the book? All right, let's just shove a book in here. A magazine, some snacks, my headphones. Hold on. <laughs> I'm sorry, I should be more prepared. Hold on. My headphones. Ooh. All right, so that fills it up. So I will have to pack differently. And then because this is leather, I'm gonna be so ginger with it. So yeah, I'm gonna have to pack differently. One of the things I wanted to show you as well is, you guys, yeah, we're all about a look. So, can you guys see this? Let me show you this first. Ooh, I'm about to put my purse on the floor. I heard the spirit of Joyce. Joyce is still with us. <laughs> I felt like she was gonna fly out that room. She's in that bag on the floor. So this is the luggage. I got the two piece luggage, the carry on and the 20 inch, well, 20 inch and 24 inch. I got this because I got that bag. Listen, who am I? Who is this person? I'm gonna leave a link to this set in the description box. So this is how I will be traveling through the airport. Okay, I can do it. I'm just gonna have to pack differently. So yeah, I love that as a look though. Okay, so there we have it. Oh, UPS. <laughs> Just another way from Amazon. <laughs> I don't know who I'm gonna be in Portugal, but I'm gonna figure it out. Um, but yeah, so let me put this here. This is where we're going. I hope you can see the frame. And if not, let me pick it up a little bit so you can see. This is where we're going. If not, no, this is where we're going. I'm 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 gonna be totally and completely honest with you cream bags, the color transfer, the rubber on the sides, because we're thrifters, we know what happens to that rubber over time. But I'm gonna enjoy this bag. I will have to pack, I absolutely will have to pack differently. So maybe the, maybe the books go in my carry-on because I have a five hour layover in New York, then what, eight hours? I need my books, I need my headphones, I need my toiletry bag, so I can go to the bathroom and freshen up and all that kind of stuff. So, yes. Anyway, thank you for joining the, the madness that is Dion Dean. I really just wanted to introduce you to this bag because I just think, let me tell you something. Let's, let's talk. For $650, what you get in this is a whole lot more. This is rivaling bags that are four times four times the amount like I am so I'm fighting the itch to go and get the red one that's 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 how I'm feeling right now <laughs> I'm fighting the itch to get the red one because this is such a good bag and it's such a vibe and for me I love that you gotta you gotta it, it's not emblazoned with a logo so it's really just like oh that's a nice bag and then you kind of like oh what's that and then you ask for you know what I mean like you you're my people, so you know what I mean? Like, you're like, oh, that's just a really nice bag. And then you see the tag, like, oh, that's Coach. That's where I am in my style journey right now, so I'm pleasantly surprised. I just need to figure out, yeah, just carry it on my shoulder, right? It does have a snap here. We'll figure it out. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Love you guys so much. Thank you for watching, and I will see you soon. Bye. Go, go.